So let's talk about that ending scene, which I'm 90% sure that some of you skipped it or didn't even know it was there. But at the ending scene, we pretty much get, you know, he, um, the Kiri guy, the Legion, pretty much tells, pretty much finds out that, you know, he found that the enemy the 86 are on their territory and he asked the big guy the kiri guy to you know investigate and you know allowed to like you know eliminate them if they are on your territory where you are and he obviously says you know agrees to it but then he he kind of remembers he gets trick he he remembers the the little sticker that was on Shin's um, little machine, the Reaper, and he, at the thought of that, he smiles very sadistically, uh, saying that pretty much like he's excited because you know he 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 gets an opportunity to kill Shin. Before you know the big battle, but let's uh, let's talk about you know, what happened this episode. So you know at so pretty much the ending episode it pretty much explains the whole episode. Pretty much we get Shin's you know inner thoughts saying that oh I'm not I'm not truly alive. I'm totally different from them. And one day they're pretty much you know they're gonna. They're gonna move on, and I'm still gonna be the Reaper, cause he he feels like he's not truly alive in the sense that he wants anything. He doesn't want anything. Like he has no desire to do anything. Like he doesn't care about anything, and he thinks since he's lacking what he he thinks that since he's lacking that um that desire that you know. He's not alive, and I mean, he's just kind of not wrong. Like, obviously, you he wants something, or he should want something. If he doesn't want something, like, why is he? You know, why does he? Pretty much, what's the reason for him living? And he kind of has this talk with Frederica about that. You know, like, oh, you know, they have this personal, I guess, personal. Um, talk about the whole, you know, I'm not truly really alive conversation, and, I mean, she, his group, that he kind of hangs around with, kind of suspects that, like, you know, his, um, he's been acting strange, you know, always being, you know, I guess, kind of suicidal, kind of, um, you know, always putting his life on the line, even when he doesn't have to, when there's, like, other ways, like, we saw the flashbacks, if you saw the episode, we saw the flashbacks of, you know, the times where he did that, you know, he disregarded his life to save others, and he, he always did, did that, and I guess his teammates are worried about that, because it feels like, you know, that's not actually him, something else is controlling him, like they said, but... You know, I guess Shin kind of brushes it off and says, you know, like, don't worry about it, it's, I'm fine. And obviously, I guess the group, you know, they're still worried for him. But I mean, it's it's not like they could do much. But um, thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and leave a comment. A few of your thoughts, and you know, I'm very excited for to watch the next episode. Next episode, because I think we should be getting you know the battle between the Legion and the 86, I guess. But thank you guys, and I'll see you next time.